Hi, this is Soul Gazer. I found this City Edition Warrior Shorts at Foot Locker, so let's look at it together. It was $80, so it's equivalent to the Swingman jersey price range. Overall, they use the same material as the uppers. Same type of knit fabric and same type of ribbons. They're using the same fabric as the jersey's logo, which is usually their patch. And print quality is the same. It's a swingman style. And there's stitch on top and bottom. And also a triangle stitch on each corner for reinforcement. The side is open so the rope can move freely. NBA logo is on the right side. It has the same print style as the upper. This is a swingman style logo, so the print is flat. Nike swoosh on the left side, and it's the same print style as the NBA logo. The print looks a little thicker. Fabric's perforation pattern is not shown on swoosh, that means the print is a little thicker. This is the inside label. It's very similar to what they have on the upper, but it doesn't have any Nike Connect. There's the sizing and there's also an NBA logo on the side. One bad thing about this part is they use a black yarn, so when you look over you can see the black stitches. So this is the inside part with the elastic and a space for a rope. So this rope area is very tight. So if you do get your rope inside, it might be very difficult for you to take it out. There are pockets on both sides. No zipper. Let's check how big the pockets are. So this is inside out. It uses mesh. A little worry about the durability. If something get caught in the hole, it could rip right away. The main feature of the shorts is the side panel. It has a blue side panel with red ribbon. Red ribbon is embossed with square Chinese style design. And if you look at it closely, there are two different squares, and one has basketball in the center. There's an additional panel at the bottom. It's Warrior Standard Shorts design. There's a small opening on the front side. It's made with different panel. Stripes are translucent tape. It matches the color of the panel with extra glossy finish to it. It's almost like a rubber, so it has a little sticky feel to it. And it's flexible, but it's not stretchable. This is the inside of the side panel. Stitch of ribbon is matched with the side panel's color to blend in. And it has a nice hem finishing. From the correct side, blue and red trim is shown. And it's not a print of two different colors, but it's two pieces of tape stitched together. And you can feel the seam allowance inside the trim, so it's hidden nicely. It has a really clean finish to it. And the inside is also a clean finish too.
This is a statement edition, so it's a cheaper model, but it looks pretty good. And I really like the finish that they use on the hem and the pattern that they use on the ribbon. But even with all that detail that I like, I still don't think this is worth $80. Um, I don't think I worry as much, and I'd rather just wait until it goes on sale. Anyway, that's it for today. Thanks for watching. Please press that like button. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you.